Yan, tapos na akong uh, i-view. <laughs> tapos na akong mag-view nung uh, titiran ko dito sa downtown. And okay naman, maganda naman yung ano, location niya. So ngayon punta tayo malapit sa school, sa Niagara College. So, mamayang 11.30 may appointment ako dun for uh, welcome tour ng campus. So, ayun yung ano, si Miss Shin yung magiging parang landlord ko dun sa unit na yun. Ako nga po eh. <laughs> no timing yung... Sakto kung kailan po maulan. <laughs> So dito malapit sa sa mga kontyatan, merong ano. Ayan, mga Filipino stores. Ayan, Tinuno, Manila. Manila Centro. Ito, naalala ko itong lugar na to, Itong ano, Sherborne, Corner, kung ano mang pangalan itong street na to. Uh, nung tinitingnan ko siya sa Google Maps, nung nasa Philippines pa ako, akala ko yung bahay na yun. Akala ko yung bahay na yun. Yung titiran ko. <laughs> so dito pala sa downtown Toronto, meron siyang meron dito mga service na bike share. So ayan yung uh, rates niya. So pwede kang humirap ng bike. Tapos may mga ano sila. May mga ibang lugar din kung saan pwede mong i-deposit yung bike. Ikibabalik mo na. Parang katulad nung sa BGC. Meron dong bike share na ano, movie tatay pangalan o mover. So dito na tayo sa may Yonge Street. So papalapit na tayo na palapit sa mga skyscrapers sa downtown. Ayun. O nung tumawid ako dun sa intersection na yun, parang nagkahiyaan kami nung ano, yung driver. So priority dito yung pedestrians. Titigil talaga sila, di sila tatawid hanggat di ka tumatawid. So, medyo ano, mapalitan pa natin yung mentality na ano, pinapauna yung sasakyan kasi dito sinusunod talaga nila na ano, pedestrians yung may right of way. Dito na tayo sa College Street, 22 College Street sa school ko sa Niagara College, Toronto. So, medyo maaga tayo ngayon. 11.30 pa yung schedule ko for the ano, campus tour. So, oras ngayon is pag-11 pa lang ata. So, mamaya pasok tayo. Tingnan natin kung pwede na bang pumasok. Papakita ko lang siguro yung aking ano. Yung schedule na nasa Gmail ko. This is the lobby. Whenever you come in like first thing, you can always upload so that you come back down. So we have five floors, okay. but because you're an NCD student, your interest is Niagara College, fifth floor, Niagara College, second floor. Okay. The lobby where we've been, and the basement for computers. Okay. Oh, yeah. Good, and you? Good. Nice to see you. How was the trip? So you're personal? Very good, no? Yeah. Yeah, I enjoyed very much. Yeah. Good. 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 Yeah. Good.
So in case you want to wash the fire that exit, mm -hmm. under every floor you do have uh, water fountains. Mm -hmm. This is the lamp. And on here, these are the, the, the monthly activities that take place. So every month we do pin uh, the activities that are taking place every day for every month. So this is for the month of August. The most recent one that happened was Saturday. We had students go to Niagara Falls. Falls. Next one happening today is this. Mm -hmm. They'll be communicating whatever is happening. Then the another one, big one is coming on Friday, the 26th, with the talent show. Mm -hmm. If you have any talent you want to showcase, you're available. <laughs> Then this will be the welcome fair that's gonna it's gonna take place somewhere else, not here because it's really big and there's so many students. Okay. We'll be communicating the venue at the time on your email. Alright, so uh, this is the second floor, we're now going to fifth floor. It's not a big place, you won't get lost, don't worry. Yeah. This is another front desk, but nobody sits here. Mm -hmm. It's just there to look fancy, that's it. <laughs> mm, classrooms. Classrooms, classrooms. Everywhere classrooms. Here is where you can come and sit and just wait for the wall. Now that school is going to begin, it's going to be very, very busy. You will see people everywhere all the time. Here is our administrative office mm -hmm. where the career services team sits. For example, now that you're here, you will need to have your resume and cover letter fit the Canadian standard if you're looking for a job. Okay. There's a way they do it. So in case you have any questions, you can always come here. But you need to send an email to here. Okay. So this is a team in the career services department. If you want to send an email to her, this is her email, she's, she's the manager. Mm -hmm. This is the job developer, you have issues with the job, you want to take, have, look for a job, you can always send it up. However, if you have a general question, you can always do career services in Toronto. Okay. Okay, so here are other email addresses. If you have a question about academics, you need, an, you need some advice, here's where you go. The career services about jobs, mm -hmm. resume, right there, it's here. Student services, ID, documents, getting the CIN number, anything, because the student services. The student association is responsible for activities, for such activities, yeah. Housing, you need, you need to find accommodation here, it's always there. You have a problem with your 365 office account, email, student email, that's the number. Records and retention, school fees, scholarship, timetable, etc. Here. Okay. Yes. So all the information is available. You just have to use it. So we are now going down to the lobby. Only a few people are taking the campus tour. Because students come in one by one. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> the library. This is the library. Um, this is the front desk. If you have any questions, you can. You need to borrow a book right there. There are books all over. Uh, you can always ask them if maybe they, you, there's the book you want is not here. They can always order it for you. Yes, but at a cost, you know. There are e-books, there are hard copies, so whichever you feel like you need to use. And if you are always so quiet, you, always, you can always come in. In case you don't have your computer, you forgot it at home, or you want to use this, you can just log in with your student information and use the computers. You can always sit here. It's always so very quiet. And extreme end, because you're doing computer, you say computer some yes. yes. So then this is lab B. So this one has got lab A, this is lab B. This is where some of your classes will take place. Although mainly it does testing, like SCCA. Uh, professional uh, exams take place in here. You may go in a seat. Okay. Um. So the washroom on every floor, there's the water fountain, every floor, that's the men's. So in here is the auditorium. So this is where workshops take place. For example, the career services, visual and events from uh, networking, 
writing resumes, um, professional dress code, from handshake to the way you see it, the entire professional etiquette way of finding a job and talking to an employer, it happens all here. However, some classes do take place as well. Now, so the elevator seems to be so slow, we run to the stairs. Okay. And then this is the, another kitchen for the students. This is the student services. Mm -hmm. In case you have an appointment one on one with them, you can always come in here and they'll be able to attend to you. So that's all the whole of it. And then these are locals whereby if you have any valuables that you need to keep in here, you can always talk to them and they can allocate you one. But it's at a cost. Ah, okay. This, as I said, is on every floor. Then we have the men's. And in here, commons. This is where you can come and maybe have your study, do whatever you want to do. It's in here. Yes. And I believe that's it. For now, but whenever you come in and you're not sure where to go, you can always talk to her. Okay. Yeah, she'll be able to direct you. Okay, that's it for now. <laughs> yeah. Okay? Okay. All right, so... It's a bit it. uh, overwhelming. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Why? How is that? Uh, it's a new country. It's a new... Yeah. yeah new country. The, the pressure is... New country, new people. Everything is... Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> so have you gotten like your SIN number? Uh, not yet. When do you have to get that? Because when you're applying for a job, you need to have that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you can apply, you can do that. You need your study permit, your letter of acceptance, mm -hmm. and your passport in order to get that. Okay. Yes. I can go. <laughs> oh, you want to go? Yeah, 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 yeah. For sure, go to around Toronto. Downtown is very interesting. Yeah. You have so many places to look at. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much, Barbara. You're welcome. You're welcome. Yeah. I hope to see you again. Thank okay. you. See All you right. later. Bye. Thank you. So we're done with uh, the college campus walk around tour. So ngayon naman ang tinutour ko is yung city of Toronto. So currently nito ako sa may uh, Bay Street. And nasa right side ko ngayon is yung old uh, Toronto City Hall. So ito kung makikita nyo, this is the TF Toronto Eaton Center. Parang mall siya to sa downtown. So napapansin ko dito sa mga park dito. Mayroong mga ano mga mga homeless na tao. So ma-advise ko sa inyo kung dito kayo sa downtown Toronto ma destino mag-aaral. Ingat-ingat na lang kayo dito sa mga lugar na gilid-gilid kasi maraming mga homeless. So, sinasabi naman sa akin ng iba na safe naman pero di mo masabi, baka biglang may gawin. Kasi yung iba parang aggressive eh. Ryerson University. Dito tayo ngayon sa Yonch Danda Square. So, Yonch Street Corner, Danda Street East. So, medyo marami pa akong gagawin ngayong araw. Um, tutor ko kayo next time dito sa downtown Toronto pag wala akong ginagawa. So, madami pa akong di nakikita dito. Sobrang laki nitong lugar na to and sobrang daming tao. So, next time, explore natin itong downtown. 